Ciao. This is the new ignition switch. I'll put a link in the description. Start by separating the upper steering column cover from the lower cover. Remove the three Phillips head screws holding the lower cover to the steering column. Lower the steering column adjuster and separate the two steering column halves. The top comes off easily. The bottom has to be worked around the place where the key goes into the ignition. Undo the electrical connector to the ignition switch. Remove the two Phillips head screws holding the ignition starter switch. Remove the ignition switch and install the new one in reverse order by putting the two Phillips head screws back in, then clipping in the connector. Before putting the steering column covers back on, you can test if the switch works correctly by turning on the car. When you put the steering column covers on, start with the lower and hook it over where the key goes into the ignition, then put the screws in. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, comment, and subscribe below so we can help other people find this video. I offer automotive education and consulting, so if you need help completing this job, my contact information is in the description below.